Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. It's Sarah once again with another video. So exciting. Two in I think a week, which is really good. Hopefully I can keep this track record up. And this video is basically going to be like an update. Um, I went shopping. It's going to be some things that I bought these past two weeks when I went shopping. And just an update on what to expect from my channel in the future. So I'm going to start with what I went shopping with and then I'll give you guys the update at the end. So I went shopping and I got some major sales and I got some really good stuff. Um, the first thing I'm really excited about is I went to Artsia. I just came back from the mall, so it's still fresh in a shopping bag. And they have actually a sale going on. Normally their stuff is really overpriced and it kind of still is overpriced even with the sale that I caught, but it's okay because I feel like the tops are really, really cute. And they wrap it really cute in this like, packaging. And what I basically got is um, two tank tops. They're both ribbed. I got this tube top that's like this blush color. And I have something like this in like a kind of gray blue color. The size medium. I kind of hope I didn't get too big. Because so I'm going to go small with my crop tops and it's you can't return it. So hopefully I didn't go too big with this one. Um, and I just really think I can wear this with anything. It's kind of basic, but I like getting basic stuff and being able to pair it with something and that be the highlight of my outfit. Um, I just don't like buying everything too extra, which I just feel like you can't wear it. If you buy a top that's extra and pants that's extra and two that extra, you just look too much. So it's good to have really simple stuff. And this is something simple that I got. Um, it was originally $48 and I got it on sale and ends up being $24, so literally half price. And I'm just really happy with this. I can't wait to wear it out. Um, I also got this top. It's ribbed like the other one. It's red. I think red looks really good on my skin. I love the way it looks on brown skin. Um, it's a tank top and it's also a crop top. Really excited about pairing this up. I feel like I can pair this with like palazzo pants maybe. Um, and wear this out. So it's on sale was $52. So how much was it originally? originally was 58 so i didn't really catch that good of a sale on this one kind of mixed up to the other one though this is just really cute and maybe i can make a styling video about how i wear these two things and other things that i got that i'll show you guys in this video um the next thing that i got also clothing wise is a shirt from nordstrom now i also got this shirt in white i got it a week ago and i already wore it so i'm not going to show it but this one um, it's just a ribbed, basic, like, long sleeve, like, Henley shirt. And I feel like you can never have too many of these. Basics are really good to have. It's really good quality. The white one looks really, really nice. And um, Henleys are just really hard to find. Really good Henleys, that is. I got a few from Urban Outfitters this past year, and they just didn't wear up very well. And I can already tell with this, the way its quality is like, that it's going to wear uh, much better than the ones that I got from Urban Outfitters no shade sorry just tea um <laughs> it's bp brand from nordstrom and i paid 25 dollars for this tea and i'm not mad at it i feel like i can wear this with anything and with my chains it'll be really cute and simple and that's what i like um the other thing that i got was from sephora pack mcgrath labs there's three mini lipsticks when you're standing on the checkout line they have a bunch of like little things that you can get and this, I, the packaging is what really threw me in. I love the packaging. It's like gold confetti at the bottom, which is really cute. And it's three lipsticks. They're all types of reds. You see it? And I love red lipsticks. Ooh, look at my highlight. I love red lipsticks. And I just feel like this is a really good trio to have if someone who likes red. And I heard that she has really good um, quality stuff. So I'm excited to try this one out because I've never tried any of her stuff before. That's one thing I got from Sephora. The other thing I got from Sephora was um, a Diva Curl product. I use Diva Curl on my hair a lot. I go to them to get my hair cut. Oops. I go to them to get my hair cuts in the city. And I actually was gonna buy a diffuser so I can do a wash and go for you guys. So it's the only type of way I wear my hair in a wash and go. But I couldn't get a diffuser and I need a diffuser for my blow dryer and to show my best type of curls, I need a diffuser. So that's coming to you guys. But I got one product that I do need for my wash and go, which is a Heaven and Hair Divine Deep Conditioner. This conditioner smells 
so good it literally smells like skittles i love just like opening it and just sniffing it because it smells so freaking good and it also makes my hair feel so soft i put it in and my hair will just slip like the slip is impeccable can i open it yeah yeah the slip is impeccable it gives you a pretty healthy amount it's 30 dollars um and it has the four gift cards so then after with the gift card it was like five dollars including another product yeah and it comes like this mint green color and i'm so excited to use it oh my god i'm so excited to use it um and i basically it makes my hair just i feel like it repairs it i recently bleached it you can't tell from the bun but i bleached the ends and the spare of the moment impulsive action and this is really gonna help save my hair this heaven and hair deep conditioner and i don't even use it as a deep conditioner sometimes mainly i just leave it in i'll wash my hair put regular conditioner in it and i'll show you guys all this in the video but um i wash my hair put regular conditioner in it then i deep condition it on top of that and i wash out mo most of the deep, deep condition and then i leave some of the rest in which is this so yeah i'll show you guys my full routine in that video that's coming soon but i got this from sephora you can get this at any store really like a ulta or regular beauty supply so that's that and then i did some online shopping and stuff i'm going to show you guys some of this is from pretty little thing another thing is from essence um so i got this pretty little thing bodysuit that i would wear out it's like kind of this is going to be the regular top and then this is like a tank top bodysuit that comes under it's attached i haven't worn it yet um because i haven't gone out yet kind of washed right now but when i do go out i will wear this top probably with some leather pants or something on the bottom definitely something on the bottom i just don't know what yet and this makes me feel like honey like this is something honey would wear in the movie honey daniels with jessica alba i just think it's really cute and i like it so that's that i got it pretty cheap from pretty little thing everyone knows pretty little thing always has a sale so just catch one of their sales and you can get some really good quality stuff so that's that and then i got this other crop top from pretty little thing and i i love wearing crop tops i wear crop tops all the time my dad calls me the crop top queen because i am the crop top queen um uh, but this one might be a little bit too cropped for me i have to see how saucy i plan on being um basically it's this that's it and it's off the shoulder and it ties in the middle i feel like karuchi has worn something like this i love the fact that it's different plaids but they're not too much they kind of go with each other well i can wear these with black jeans or leather pants and you can't see the string but where is it this is the string and it ties together in the middle like that and it's off the shoulder um i'm gonna keep this hopefully i think i'm gonna keep it and I can just wear it with something that's high-waisted enough where it's not too much of my stomach being out. This is another one of those going outfit out outfits that I probably am going to wear. And I'm actually going to do a video of my going out outfits and style all the things that I have and how I would wear it going out um, for you guys in a different video. But that's not this. This is not that. Um, my next purchase, which was my most expensive purchase, and I'm going to chill after this. I told my friend I'm done. And he doesn't believe me, but I really, really am done. Maybe, hopefully, probably not. Um, <laughs> it's this bag that I got. It's like mirror reflective. It's so cool. It's off-white. And I've been looking at off-white bags for a while. And I caught a really good sale on Sense. Well, Essence, I think it's called. It's S-S-E-N-S-E. -S -E and I'm gonna do a whole video about that as well, um, where I get discounted stuff from and how I catch a good sale and buy my designer items. But um, this is just one of the designer items I bought recently on a sale. It was $1,300 originally. This is flipped. $1,300 originally, the off-white um, strap. It was $1,300 originally and I caught it for I think like $680 which is so good i had to get it that's literally half price no it was 52 percent off not even 50 52 percent off so i was like i have to get this bag um and it's not like the typical off-white bags i was looking at with the diagonal stripes and the black and white it was kind of different and i feel like this you can wear with more things than the regular black and white diagonal stripe off-white bags i was looking at before and also came with this and the picture the model was wearing it 
And I just didn't really think that my bag would come with it, but it did. It's like this little scarf that you can tie on the strap of the bag. I put it on today because it matched my outfit, but I probably will not wear this normally. It also comes with this other strap like this. So you can wear it as like a regular purse or you can wear it as a crossbody with this strap. And this strap you can take off and I plan on taking it off and being able to switch it up so that I can get a, I can get different looks out of it. Um, right now I'm looking into getting either the pink one or the blue one. If you guys have any suggestions on what you think would probably be best, let me know in the comments. I'm definitely not, I don't want to do black because I feel like that's kind of boring. Um, so let me know what color you guys think is best, pink or blue or purple. I don't know if there's yellow, but yeah, let me know what you guys think is best. And this is a little regular strap. So yeah, that's all I basically got in the past two weeks, which is kind of a lot. I, tr I usually don't shop this much, but um, I really need to start shopping more. Actually, this. I got, <laughs> I got this hoodie from Zara's. Um, yeah, I got this hoodie in gray and black. The black I already wore and it's kind of dirty, so I'm not showing that. But this one is my first time wearing it. It's just really good quality, it's soft. And like I said earlier, I needed basics. And um, this I can wear out shopping, just doing regular everyday activities where I have a lot of crop tops and I can't wear that to do normal stuff. This I can wear just with my everyday life. So I got this in gray and black and it was $25, which is not that bad. So yeah, this is what I got when I went shopping. Um, so what's to come? What's to come is I wanna do a wine tasting before I go out, kind of like a get ready with me wine tasting. Um, that is going to be interesting because I'm going to be doing my makeup most likely while wine tasting. Do not judge the way I do my makeup. I'm not a professional. I don't claim to be professional. I know I'm a hot mess. Do not come for my life when that video comes out. This is a forewarning. If you come for my life, I would just really suck. <laughs> I'll move on, but it would just really, really suck. So don't come for my life. Um, I wanna do a curly hair tutorial. I just need to get my life together and get a diffuser first that fits my blow dryer. And then that is coming for you guys. Um, and then I have a haul that I'm thinking about doing. I have a couple of different websites in mind that I'm thinking about getting this, um, doing the haul for. But I don't want to do pretty little thing and I don't want to do misguided just because I don't normally shop there. I want it to be someplace where I can wear, I know I'm going to wear the clothes in the future. I'm not rich. I'm not going to waste money on $200 on stuff that I know I'm not going to wear and I don't want to return. So I'm just going to find a website that I really like and do a haul for them. And yeah, if you guys have any other ideas of where or what I should do in the future, comment below let me know make sure you guys like this video make sure you guys subscribe to my channel because i have more good stuff coming to you guys and yeah bye